the previous class we are discussed the human reproduction right human reproduction reproductive health so now in this class we will discuss previous questions of CET. The chapter is human health and disease, right? Human health and diseases. So we have provided the materials and go through that human health and diseases. So 2014, 2014 question carried the CET. First question. Internal bleeding, muscular pain, blockage of intestinal passage, and anemia are some of the symptoms caused due to infection by Today, These are the symptoms, they are given symptoms. Internal bleeding, that means intestinal, is an intestinal parasite, that means muscular pain, muscular pain, right? Blockage of the intestinal passage that leads to what happens? That leads to so anemic condition. So these are the symptoms which are caused by the illness that is the oscaris. Oscaris. You know the symptoms is internal bleeding, muscular pain, blockage of the intestinal passage, anemia. These are the diseases of oscariasis this is a oscariasis disease right this is oscariasis disease caused by oscaris for example oscaris lumbricots lumbricots on such species oscaris lumbricots cause the disease oscariasis right oscaris is the common name so, which is an element? Elminthus. Elminthus. It affects the organ intestine. Intestine is the affected organ, right? Oscariasis disease. <clears throat> you know, in human health and disease, there are different types of diseases are there, whether they are infectious disease or non infectious disease. In the infectious disease, they are spread from person to person, right? Those are infectious diseases, right? Or communicable diseases, those are also called communicable diseases. And non-infectious diseases, they are confined to the infected person only, right? So they are not spread. These are non-communicable diseases. You know, in case of infectious diseases, for example, bacterial diseases, you can take bacterial diseases. So, bacterial diseases, example, typhoid, for example, typhoid fever, typhoid fever. No, each of the new diseases, disease causing organism, infected, yeah, or the infected, whether the target model. And symptoms they are very important. If any diagnostic test is there, so that is also very important for the complete examination, right? For example, you know, typhoid fever, typhoid fever caused by the bacterium Salmonella typhi. Salmonella typhi, right? Salmonella typhi, Salmonella para typhi. Here, the causative organism is Salmonella typhi. So, what happens here? The symptoms for typhoid fever is a high fever, sustained high fever that is 39 degrees Celsius to 40 degrees Celsius. That means uh, the disease, the person who is suffering from typhoid fever, typhoid fever, where uh, it uh, affects the small intestine. What is the affected organ here? Small intestine. Small intestine. Right. So, through the contaminated food and water, through the contaminated food and water, typhoid fever that will be transmitted. So, Kalushitava Yukhita Tahara Matujir Mutatra, Viroga, Kartavutte. Constipation, constipation, headache, chill, all those of the symptoms of typhoid fever. 
you know typhoid fever is detected by a diagnostic test called vidal test vidal test remember it is very important for the on the examination no which test is used to detect the typhoid fever right vidal test vidal test vidal test the more diagnostic test for detection of typhoid fever caused by salmonella typhi is a bacterium and one more bacterium is pneumonia pneumonia you know pneumonia is caused by streptococcus caused by streptococcus pneumoniae pneumoniae streptococcus pneumoniae and uh, hemophilus influenzae also cause pneumonia hemophilus influenzae right so through the transmission of uh, aerosols or droplets this pneumonia can take infect so it uh, blocks where due to filling of fluid filling of fluid to the lungs lungs so that may affect the respiration process streptococcus pneumonia right so all of you know like fluid fill aga mutta anta enagutte namma on the respiration ge related aagi kattu kondrelu transport right so fever the chill headache pain these are the symptoms so yav de one disease symptoms kottira ini adre question kottira now in one question nodira ni tansa kattta beku ಏನ್ ಅಂತ ಬೇಕು ಡಿಸೀಸಸ್ ಸಿಂಪ್ಟಮ್ಸ್ ನ ಪರ್ಫೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಗಿ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಆ ಸಿಂಪ್ಟಮ್ಸ್ ಕೊಟ್ಟು ಯಾವ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಅಂತ ಯಾವ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ಆರ್ಗನಿಸಂ ಅಫೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆರ್ಗನ್ಸ್ ಯಾವುದು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತಕ್ಕಂತ ಕ್ವೆಶ್ಚನ್ಸ್ ಇರ್ತದೆ ಅಂತ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಸೋ ಇನ್ಹಲೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಡ್ರಾಪ್ಲೆಟ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ದ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಮಿಷನ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಡಿಸೀಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ಓವರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ರೈಟ್ देयर ಆರ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಡಿಸೀಸಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಡಿಪ್ಟೀರಿಯೇ ಕಾಸ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ಕೊರ್ಮಿ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ಟೀರಿಯಂ ಡಿಪ್ಟೀರಿಯೇ ರೈಟ್ plain so all these you know why it is is bandre so syllabus prakara yavide common cold or what common cold so nasal cavity and respiratory tract is affected right not the lungs common cold by the rhinovirus 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 is caused by the what common cold which organ is affected nose and respiratory respiratory tract nose and respiratory tract is affected affected organ <coughs> so here so what happens here the individual suffering up to 3 to 7 days there may be a nasal tiredness occurs right so nasal tiredness up to nasal tiredness up to 3 to 7 days more the word is that we negri age irutha alva nama nasal andre moodina bhaga yanagutte sokka tired aagutha right so why are this protozoan disease bandre the disease is caused by protozoans for example malaria 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 disease which is caused by a tiny protozoan that is plasmodium plasmodium so there are four different species of plasmodium are there plasmodium vivax for example plasmodium vivax plasmodium ovale right plasmodium malariae malariae and plasmodium falciparum falciparum plasmodium falciparum these are the four different species nodi one question varutte ide among plasmodium species which species the cause the malaria which is which is highly fatal in nature that is highly fatal in nature that is plasmodium falciparum so one minute plasmodium falciparum so plasmodium falciparum it is highly fatal in nature right in case of human beings so during infection by plasmodium where it 
इट स्प्रेड थ्रू द मॉस्किटो फीमेल अनाफिलिस मॉस्किटो फीमेल अनाफिलिस मॉस्किटो मॉस्किटो राइट फीमेल अनाफिलिस मॉस्किटो वेयर द मलेरिया स्प्रेड्स वेयर द इंफेक्शियस स्टेज ऑफ मलेरिया will be released into the blood stream by biting by the mosquito those infectious stages are called sporozoids sporozoids remember the question was there sporozoids infectious stages of plasmodium or malaria parasite yes yeah, sporozoids sporozoids of infectious stages the question was yaw stage infection madutte infectious stages And they are multiplied in the stomach of the mosquito. Remember, so the affected organ previously they can affect the liver, liver cells, hepatic cells. After that, it can affect the red blood corpuscles. Where sexual reproduction takes place in the liver and bursting of the liver cell. Right. So here the uh, it affects the liver as well as the first it can affect the liver cells. Essential reproduction occurs and bursting of the the plasmodium, uh, the liver cells leads to release of plasmodium and they can target the RBC. After that, essential reproduction occurs in RBC cells, bursting of RBC, release of plasmodium along with the along with the toxic substance what we call as chemozyme. Chemozyme. Any question about that? Please say it. Chemozyme is a toxic substance. Released by ruptured RBC. Remember, very important. Released by ruptured RBC. Right? That's why malaria. It is. It's what happens. High fever with chill. Chill. Right? High fever with chill. So that may vary. That means fever varies every alternating hour or days. Why? Because because it depends on amount of exposure released into the Into the plasma, right? That's why. So this is malaria parasite. Plasmodium causes the malaria disease. So I do one protozoan disease. One more protozoan disease now. Second part, the second PUC. Yeah, we do amoebiosis or amoebic dysentery. Amoebiosis or amoebic dysentery. So entamoeba is to like a entamoeba. Entamoeba. Histolytica, endemic or histolytica, histolytica causes amoebiasis. Amoebiasis is also called amoebic dysentery. Also called what? Amoebic dysentery. Take care of it. Amoebiasis or amoebic dysentery. Where contaminated food and water. Where it is a mode of spreading of the disease, where abdominal pain, or abdominal pain, abdominal pain, right? So constipation, constipation, cramps, cramps, you know, sudden pain in the muscle, muscles, muscles, skeletal muscles. ये ना भी ये दर नंबर डे दिए ना कि आपको बच्चों में से पेन बढ़ कि दर इस पॉड क्रांस क्रांस राइट स्टूल ये टेक्सस में इंफेक्शन विल बी सीरियर दैट लीड्स व्हाट आपका स्टूल कंटेनिंग म्यूकस एंड ब्लड म्यूकस एंड ब्लड दिस आर द सिम्टम्स ऑफ एंटरीबा स्टोलाइटिका एंटरीबा स्टोलाइटिका राइट सो द Uh, what the, these four protozoan diseases? Coming to Helminthus diseases, sorry, Helminthus diseases here is there. On the Ascaris, we have studied Ascaris, or the Ascariasis. The Ascaris is a causative organism. Ascariasis is a disease. Right? One more is Filariasis uh, or Elephantiasis. Filariasis or Elephantiasis, elephantiasis. So this disease caused by the helminthus, that is Ucheraria, Ucheraria. 
the eukarya disease the causative organism for example the species eukarya bancrofti eukarya bancrofti eukarya malai so these are the causative organism that causes sedimentation is a chronic inflammation of the organs where causes that is spread or infected to must do where they can live for long period of time for years especially in case of lymphatic vessels lymphatic vessels of lower limbs lower limbs growing part scrotum part growing part is affected affecting area that leads to what happens that leads to that leads to abnormal increase or swelling of the of the lower limbs the legs so scrotum part growing part so where the lower limbs looks like a elephant the legs that's why elephantiasis cause the filarial worm that is filariasis filariasis that we know correct okay so here what are parts gross deformities of the vertebral gross deformities what are parts here abnormal growth abnormal growth how oh, a severe malfunction due to abnormal delivery of the blood right and uh, uh, to the different the, to the body parts ee vandu infection aagidha jagare sariyaga rithya irukkanta circulation aagudilla so avage iragutte antare so mal function aagutta area adike now gross deformities and delicacy related to ukeria bacteria ukeria malai causes filariasis or elephantiasis disease remember the ascariasis disease elephantiasis disease these are caused by the hemingthus ascaris for example ascaris of the goats and ukeria example ukeria malai ukeria bacteria disease you know so these are hemingthus diseases fungal diseases example is a ringworm right ringworm ringworm fungus called ringworm microsporum microsporum trichophyton trichophyton rubrum epidermophyton epidermophyton trichophyton microsporum trichophyton rubrum so these may causes the disease ringworm disease ring worm this is a dry scaly appearance right where there is top part growing part right the skin reasons right that is whenever there is a uh, moisture condition it is a favorable condition for the growth of fungi they can grow very well that's why you know that fungal infections are more during rainy seasons generally because of moisture content right the suitable condition for the growth of the fungi so like that there are different diseases are there so that's why you have to know the causative organism symptoms symptoms affecting the organ how the one one question of study mark ne nodi the bandi andre last year the so adhe question anta artala ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ರಿಲೇಟೆಡ್ ಆಗಿ ಏನೇನೆಲ್ಲ ಕ್ವಶನ್ಸ್ ಬರ್ಬೋದು ಅನ್ನೋದಕ್ಕೆ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಕೊಟ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಆಗಿದೆ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಯಾವ ಟು ಮೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಎ ಕಾಲಮ್ ಒಂದು ಕಾಲಮ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೋಬೇಕು ಎಲ್ಲ ನೀಟ್ ಆಗಿ ಸೊ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ಟೀರಿಯಲ್ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಅದು ಯಾವುದು ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ಟೀರಿಯಲ್ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ಆರ್ಗಾನಿಸಮ್ ರೈಟ್ ಅಫೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಮಿಷನ್ ಸಿಂಪ್ಟಮ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಎನಿ ಮಾಲಿಕ ಸಾರಿ ಡಯಾಗ್ನೋಸ್ಟಿಕ್ ಟೆಸ್ಟ್ ಇಸ್ देयर ಆರ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಟ್ರೈ ಸೊ ಆ ಚಾರ್ಟ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡ್ರೆ ಕೆನ್ ಈಸಿ ಟು ಕೆನ್ ನೋಡಿ ಕಷ್ಟ ಇದೆ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಯಾವ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಇದೆ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ ಇದೆ ಅಲ್ಲ ಡಿಸೀಸ್ 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 
Right, helmet the disease here is right. How the fuck? Right, that's why you can study. So, okay, area, I'm going to tell you how to get okay area that causes the area is right. Chronic inflammation of the body organs that is not a symptom, right? It's symptom for the other. Psychophyta, psychophyta causes rainbow, it's dry skin, yeah, for us on the skin, right? The other plasmodium causes the malaria and the chill fever, right? So, every alternate days. So ascaris, ascaris from records causes the ascaris disease and these are the symptoms. That's why option C is the right answer. Next, the mature infective stage of malarial parasite, which is a transform from mosquito to man or the category. We have studied a mature infectious stage, only mature infectious stage. Of malarial parasite, malarial parasite. Transmit that in the transmit that in mosquito, mosquito to man during the biting, right? So infectious cases are those corozoids, neurozoids, trochozoids, gametocytes are like that. But gametocytes are like that. Gametocytes they are transfer. From the man to the mosquito by biting of the female mosquito to infected person. Right? Where some of the mirosoids, mirosoids, they are converted into gamete-producing cells. Mirosoids, these are the cells, plasmodium, right? Different stages, different. For example, the feeding stage is for trochozoid. A feeding stage is called trochozoids. Where it can feed and increases the size, cell size. It is called cizone, right? That's why mirosoids after released, released from the liver cells as well as the harvest cells. Generally, those cells are called mirosoids. These mirosoids they are converted into gamete-producing cells, what we call as gametocytes. Those gametocytes they are transferred into mosquito while biting. And in the mosquito, stomach of mosquito, these produces gametes, male and female gametes, and they are for the fusion of male and female gametes. Then fertilization occurs. That is the formation of those sporozoids. So sporozoids, they are uh, migrated from stomach to the salivary gland of the mosquito. So when our biting of the mosquito to help the person, these sporozoids they are spread into the, they are transferred to the bloodstream. That's why. Infectious cases are those sporozoids. Infectious cases are sporozoids, sporozoids, trochozoids, gametocytes. That is right. Option A, sporozoids. Right. Next. One of the following is incorrect about the cancer cells. One of the following is a non-infectious disease. Remember, cancer is a non-infectious disease. So cancer, cell is some of the particular type of the yaw area to cut by the incorrect option. Take it there. No, they exhibit the property of contact inhibition. Exhibit the property of contact inhibition. What do you mean by contact inhibition? You know, in case of human beings, cell division and the metabolic activity they are. Controlled, controlled and regulated. Remember, multiplication of cells or division. Cell division is a highly controlled mechanism or regulated mechanism, where the cell undergoes cell division. Cell undergoes division. Cell division. Whenever it comes in contact with the another cell, where the division is stopped. Division is stopped. For example, here there is any any injury occurs. Right, this portion the cell may rupture. Then what happens automatically? These cells start to division. Right, whenever they are coming contact with another cell, cell division it is inhibited. So this property it is the property of normal cells. Normal cells shows contact inhibition. Remember, normal cells shows contact inhibition. But the cancer cells, they lack, they lost the property. Cancer cells, 
cancer cells lost contact inhibition property remember that leads to continuous abnormal cell division proliferation abnormal cell division that leads to formation of the masses of cells this masses of cell it is called tumor remember due to lack of contact inhibition contact inhibition it is not the property of cancer cells where normal cell shows contact inhibition one cell come in contact with another cell due to the regulatory mechanism where that those cells they are not involved in cell division right so contact inhibition the contact inhibition inhibition of what inhibition of cell division but the cancer cells they lost their property of contact inhibition they continuously divide continuously cell division occurs uncontrolled cell division leads to formation of a masses of cells what we call as a tumor tumor that can be now cancer tumor so that can be mean. so cancer cells do not shows contact inhibition property remember very important Whereas contact inhibition property only in case of normal cells. Only option A, they exhibit property of contact inhibition property that is incorrect about the cancerous cells. Remember, option A is incorrect about the cancerous cells. They do not exhibit the contact inhibition. But only exhibit contact inhibition that property. That's why option A it is incorrect about cancerous cells. option b no they are metastatic metastatic property metastasis what do you mean by metastasis for cancer cells ya tandayagi tandane kelavu properties irutave metastasis anadrenu where some cancer cells for example this is a tumor so this is a tumor anadrenu some of the cancers they are small small some of the cancers they are they are small and they cut out the small and they are move they are move to distant place distant place place how through blood through blood cancer tumor in the tumor in the aa jagada ಕೆಲವೊಂದು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ಸರ್ ಸೆಲ್ಸ್ ಸ್ಕ್ವಾಗಳು ಸ್ಕ್ವಾಗಳು ಏನು ಕಟ್ ಆಗ್ತವೆ ಬ್ಲಡ್ ಮೂವ್ ಆದ್ರೆ ಬೇರೆ ಜಾಗಕ್ಕೆ ಬಾಡಿ ಅಂತ ಬೇರೆ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಗೆ ಹೋಗ್ತಾರೆ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಮೂವ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ವೇರ್ ದೆ ಆರ್ ಲಾರ್ಜ್ ಎಲ್ಲಿ ಅವು ಉಳ್ಕೊಂತವೆ देयर ಇಸ್ ಎ ಗ್ರೋತ್ ಆಫ್ ಅನದರ್ ಫಾರ್ಮೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಅನದರ್ ಟ್ಯೂಮರ್ ಡ್ಯೂ ಟು ಅನ್ಕಂಟ್ರೋಲ್ ಸೆಲ್ ಡಿವಿಜನ್ ದೆ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರಾಲಿಫರೇ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ ಡಿವಿಜನ್ ಲೀಡ್ಸ್ ಟು ಫಾರ್ಮೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ದ Mass of cells. This is another human. This property is called metastasis property. Metastasis property is what? Where some of the cancer cells they are swallowed from the tumor and move distance of place to blood and where they get lodged and start to multiply and that leads to formation of the tumor. that property is called metastasis property and such type of tumors they can invade and spread there and cause cancer these are uh, malignant tumors those are called malignant malignant tumors they are not localized they are not confined to a particular area some of the tumors they are not spread there. such tumors are called benign tumors benign tumors remember benign tumors and malignant tumors right that's why right. so b is the property of cancer cells correct but if they exhibit mass proliferation or you know right mass proliferation mass of cell division and the jaast cells formation of the that is also property of cancer cell they are produced by the cellular oncogenes of normal cell cell activated that is also correct no activation of cellular oncogenes oncogenes means what cancer causing genes are called oncogenes 
Oncology means cancer. Study of cancer, oncology. Cancer causing the cell or oncology is their activity. What happens? Where normal cells they are converted into cancer cells. So uncontrolled cell division that occurs. That is the property of cancer cells. That's why like option A. The exhibit property of contact tension is another wrong, incorrect option. That's why option A is the right option. Next. Heroin is heroin is a cannabinoid diacet diacetyl morphine chemically commonly called coke and crack used to treat mental illness like depression and insomnia. Very heroin. So now you have concept to some of the drugs. Drugs now study more about it. Concept more there. You know. Morphins, acetylation of morphine that leads to obtaining of heroin. Heroin, right? Low sugar than that is heroin. This heroin it is chemically diacetyl morphine. Diacetyl morphine it is chemically heroin. Which is obtained by the plant latex of plant. What is that? Latex of poppy plant. Which plant? Latex of poppy plant. Poppy plant. Capover somniferum. Capover. Capover somniferum. Poppy plant, commonly called poppy plant. Scientific name is Capover somniferum. That's the case of the case. Capover somniferum. It is a plant where from the latex of poppy plant where the heroin is obtained. Morphines are obtained. And these are the drugs. So that's why. So the cannabinoids. Cannabinoids. So these are the also drugs which are obtained by cannabis sativa. The plant name cannabis. Sativa, cannabis, sativa, cannabinoids. How many called coke and crack? No. So here, here, cocaine, cocaine or coca, obtained from the coca plant, erythroxylum coca, erythroxylum. Coca, where often they can uh, produce cocaine, also drugs. This is also called crack or coke. Remember, right? Crack or coke. Whereas heroin is also called smack, also called smack. Smack and the kind of heroin, you know, the morphine scale, smack and the kind of heroin, smack and the kind of heroin. Whereas cannot. Uh, Cocaine cell and the kind of crack can be there. Cocaine cell can be crack and the kind of heroin. Remember, right? That's why commonly called coke and crack. What do they do? Cocaine cell used to treat mental illness like depression, insomnia. That is the thing. But lethargy case, LSD, LSD. What do they do? They are doing that. For the option B, heroin is diacetyl morphine. Chemically, it is a diacetyl morphine. If it's to 2014, you can take another question. So 2015, you can take another question. Here, there. Okay. Smack and crack are produced from. Okay. Here, there. 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 This name is called two morphines. How do you morphines? Can you tell me this name? So morphines they are obtained from the latex of poppy plant. The plant name, scientific name is Papaver somniferum. Papaver somniferum, poppy plant, commonly called poppy plant. Poppy plant, right? So crack. Crack, crack के जाने के लिए वो कोकाइन से करते हैं और वो कोकाइन ओपन फ्रॉम द प्लांट एरिट्रो एरिट्रोजाइलम एरिट्रोजाइलम को 
coca erythroxylum coca so there are available as snack and crack obtained produced from option a cannabis sativa wrong cannabinoids they are obtained tapo over sorry friend that is wrong cannabis sativa atropa veridona wrong erythroxylum coca and atropa veridona wrong but you put there option b and a tapo over sorry friend Erythroxylum, but it is xylem. I use xylem. Erythroxylum, coca. So option D is the right. Other one, option D is the right. Next, which of the following is not correct with respect to malaria? Which of the following is not correct with respect to malaria? The correct one. Ready? Option A. RBC is rupture and release hemozyme. Hemozyme. Which causes chill? That is correct. Hemozyme is a toxic substance. Hemozyme, hemozyme is a toxic substance which is released by ruptured RBC. Released by ruptured RBC. And whenever there is a release of hemozyme to plasma, that leads to chill, chill fever, chill. That is why I am telling you all. मलेरिया इनफेक्शन सो ज्वर मत चली मलेरिया Infectious stages of malaria or parasite is plasmodium. Infectious stage. In our mind, that is sporozoids. These sporozoids that are multiplied in the stomach of mosquito. Remember, stomach of mosquito, not in man, not in man, right? So whenever, whenever gametocytes. They are enters into the mosquito while biting. Where these gametes, they are fused to fertilization, enters in the stomach of the mosquito and produces finally converted into the the ten thousand sporozoids. These sporozoids they are migrated from stomach to the salivary gland, and whenever there is a biting enters by the mosquito to the healthy person. Then there is a release of infectious sporozoids into the bloodstream, reaches the liver, and targets RBC, liver cell RBC. I get the process left side. Right? It is a digenic process. To be digenic, can they know? It needs two host organisms. For his man, one is mosquito. So that's why plasmodium is digenic in nature because it needs two host organisms for the completion of their. Life cycle and a life of a chapter of a complete model. Look here. That the yellow flower of the life of a flower is that the man is not a mosquito. That is the digenic and the now that is not the. So sporozoids are made by blood. That is not correct. That is not correct. That is not correct with respect to malaria. Next, female amount of this mosquito is the vector. That is correct. So vector is vector one disease. Female anopheles mosquito is the vector. Next, malignant malaria is caused by Plasmodium falciparum. That is correct. So Plasmodium falciparum, falciparum, that causes malignant malaria. That spreads overall body, right? So that is a fatal in nature. Fatal in nature. Plasmodium, different species. Plasmodium malariae, Plasmodium vivax, Plasmodium falciparum. Right, like there are different species of there. So among those, Plasmodium falciparum is highly fatal in nature and causes malignant malaria. Right. So that's why option B, sporozoids multiply in blood, it is the not correct, not correct with respect to malaria. Next question, next question, Lord. Where natural killer lymphocytes are examples for? Natural killer. 
natural pillar lymphocytes are example for physical barrier cytokinetic barrier cellular barriers physiological barrier you know this comes under the innate immunity inborn immunity or the innate immunity immunity overall the mechanism where they can able to fight against the infectious or pathogen or antigenic molecules that system it is immune system so that is immunity so natural killer lymphocytes natural cells nk cells that are individual nk cells for example for the but physical barriers innate immunity is by different types of barriers one is a physical barrier physical barriers in our go we are studied physical barriers are skin and mucus skin and mucus these are physical barriers next to physiological barriers physiological barriers physiological barriers are here physiological barriers generally saliva saliva sweat sebum tears tears right gastric juice right these are the physiological barriers so cytokinin barriers cytokinin cytokinin barriers are interferons interferons these are interfering molecules antiviral drugs so they can produce by the viral infected cells and they can they can prevent the infection of virus to the neighboring cells that's why cellular barriers cellular barriers and there are here cellular barriers are polymorphonuclear leukocytes natural killer cells these are cellular barriers so innate immunity is by different types of barriers physical barrier physiological barrier cellular barrier cytokinetic barriers are all okay so otherly natural killer cells polymorpho nuclear leukocytes that is what the neutrophils these are belonging to cellular barriers cellular barriers that's why option c option c is the right answer next a person who has allergy a person who has allergy what do you mean by allergy allergy is the exaggerated immune response exaggerated response by the immune system to what to the antigens which are present in the environment like dust pollen grains all those kinds and the water all the antigens ke immediately exaggerated immune response maartala that is called allergy and the substance which cause allergy what we call as allergens the substance which cause allergy called as allergens so during allergy what happens the type of antibody produced or yeah antibodies are there ige or the direct question is allergic reaction other nam deha utpadana aagtana the antibody yavu andre igg igg antibody so igg the first antibody ig igg so the cross class acta igm first antibody iga the first term igg so by the marshals they produce the chemicals chemical serotonin right histamine so that leads to allergic reaction during that time the antibody ige produced really very important ige immunoglobulin e is our antibodies ig so igg iga igm ige igb right and these are the some of the antibodies right so ige is the next a doctor identifies symptoms of nasal congestion at a sore throat hoarseness cough in a patient the conclusion is that the patient is infected by a pathogen nodi nodi diseases mele enga the symptoms kele nodi now 2014 question nu kuda one question nodi yavudu ask ayi sambandhapatta ki 2016 nalli kuda adhe thara one question kodu symptoms kodidare yav disease anta kodu illi which pathogen that causes these type of symptoms anta kelidare right that's why here nodi headache 
nasal congestion nasal congestion the mugi problem right sore throat sore throat harshness harshness is you know you can't play it cut it out that is harshness right cough cough the cough you know here the reason no common cold right caused by ringo virus ringo virus that's why right. option a ringo virus so option a is the right answer next identify the the incorrect statement and correct one is that is incorrect statement from the following from the following next option a is interferon kills virus macrophages or the phagocytic cells of course macrophages these are phagocytic cells b cells produces antibody is that because b cells produce antibody is antibody mediated immunity b cells bone marrow cells or bone marrow lymphocytes t cells produce cell mediated immunity response of t cells is called cell mediated immunity of course cell t cells directly attack the pathogen or antigen that's why it is cell mediated immunity cell mediated immunity t cells Whether so, T cell, plasmic cells, T cell cells, plasmid cells, mammary cells, all those kinds, right? So that is interferon kill virus. The problem. Interferon is they are produced by viral infected cells. These are cytokine diarrhea. Interferon is not all cytokine diarrhea. They are produced by viral infected cells. They can regulate the further infection by the virus to neighboring cells. Neighboring cells instead of killing, these are antiviral drugs, of course, antiviral proteins. So, other than the option A is the is the incorrect statement. And then now, how the work? So, option A is the incorrect statement about this. So, in the question only, level question. Some of the events occurs during life cycle of plasmodium are given below. Identify the correct statement. Identify the correct statement. Pay attention. Last one in life cycle. So, what will happen? There are those statements. What is that? Our statements are the correct statement. Then, what will happen? Then, what will happen? 2016. Then, the question will be answered. Two questions. Then, the fourth question will be answered. 2016. Then, first, A. The gametocyte develop in the RBC. Gametocyte develop in RBC. Correct. When mosquito bites a man, gametocytes are injected. That is wrong. When mosquito bites a man, sporozoids, sporozoids, sporozoids. What is sporozoids? These are infectious stages of malaria or called sporozoids. They are released into the bloodstream of man, not the gametocytes. Remember, that's why option B is not correct regarding the, the malaria virus. Right? Next, the sporozoids reproduce sexually in the liver cells. That is wrong. Sporozoids uh, uh, they can uh, reproduce asexually, asexually in liver cells, not sexual. Female mosquito take up sporozoids by blood means. That is wrong. Female mosquito take up gametocyte, gametocyte during blood means. Bite मारता है ना, blood में suck मारता है ना तारे, gametocyte को तो ध्यान नहीं था. Mosquito के आगे ना B, C, D. These are the these are the not correct with respect to life cycle of Plasmodium. What happens where the life cycle of Plasmodium begins with the infection of Plasmodium or sporozoids to the healthy person, healthy person where the sporozoids are released. That means Plasmodium reaches the bloodstream, reaches the liver cells. What happens in the liver cells? A sexual reproduction occurs. And uh, proposals are feeding stage. These are virozoids. Again, those uh, plasmodium infect the other liver cells. And some of the those plasmodium they target the RBC, red blood corpuscles. And in RBC cells, where the infection occurs, a sexual reproduction occurs. So rupturing of RBC that leads to release of plasmodium. Along with that, a toxic substance what we call as hemozine that causes the chill fever. Right. And these uh, mirosoids, they are uh, converted into gamete-producing cells, what is called as gametocytes. Whenever the mosquito bites the infected person, these gametocytes enter into the stomach, and the sexual reproduction occurs in the stomach. That leads to formation of uh, the sporozoids. Sporozoids they are migrated from uh, stomach to the salivary glands, and whenever there is a biting, again biting occurs to healthy person, normal healthy person. 
these chromosomes they are released ligated to the blood stream and the life cycle is continuous. Right? That's why, that's why. So all the B, C, D options they are not correct with respect to plasmodium life cycle. So gametocytes they are developed in RBC and the right? That is the characteristic. All the work, gametocytes developed in RBC is the characteristic. So option A, option A is the right option. Next, so 2017 German question is there. So in humans, common code is caused by in humans, common code is caused by. So there is that question, rhinovirus, right? Rhinovirus, retrovirus, baculovirus, rhabdovirus, rhinovirus. That's right. Rhinovirus, common code is caused by rhinovirus. Common code is caused by rhinovirus, right? Next. Which of the following vector borne disease caused by Aedes mosquitoes? Which of the following vector borne vector borne diseases caused by Aedes, Aedes mosquitoes is the cause of the disease you have to tell Ascariasis and filariasis, malaria and sleeping sickness, dengue and chikungunya, kala azar and filariasis. So the direct question is dengue and chikungunya, dengue and chikungunya caused by Aedes mosquito. Aedes Mosquito, right? Option C is the right answer. So these are some questions uh, uh, with respect to health, human health and diseases, right? So in the remaining questions in the right, 2017, 18, 19, and 20. Right? So those remaining questions we will discuss in the next class, right? And